Hello everybody and welcome back to Dark Souls 2. Actually, I'm gonna send this fella back to his world because I fucked up when I summoned him. I didn't actually mean to, I was hitting buttons in the main menu and it was somehow transitioning them into this game, so sorry about that whoever the fuck you were, but no offense meant. Just didn't really want to summon because I'm going to teach people how to do this fucking exploit. So, if you're maybe a developer watching this, please look away. That'd be nice. Um, as for everyone else, that's fine to watch. Go for it. Nope, nope. Just not dealing with that today. Well, that sucks. I'm gonna have to go back for that. Fuck you. Nuisance. Assholes with the damn shields cowering. Alright, now, for this exploit you're going to need this fella. Now, this is all over the internet, so I mean, if you're looking at this and you're like, I've already seen how to do this, why are you showing me this? Let's get this. That's fine, but this video is going to be just kind of quickly covering it. I already covered it for a, uh, a later game boss with a different summon, just proving that it can be done with whoever you want, not just with uh, the Swordmaster. But... Oh shit. Scared me half to death, shit dude. Calm down. No. Bad. Now sword mask can kill your ass, I don't care. Thank you. There we go. And he takes damage because he's using the chaos blade. So not my choice, but apparently he likes it. One more time. See, that's kind of what I was waiting on. There we go. This is why co op's so nice. Oh, wow. I've never actually got him to drop his shield, so it's kind of cool. take a little bit of punishment just to get that done, but... That was kind of a cool visual effect there. If you, um, if you saw that, that was really cool. Like, his, uh, his blade was, like, coated in blood as it slid through the enemy. It was really awesome. So I need, like, 36 strength for that, so that's not happening for quite some time. Okay, now for this fella right here, I'm just going to use the, um, damn it, I always miss that first one. I always hit the second one. Ooh. <laughs> you guys kill each other. Be nice. No. There you go. That's right, you pay attention to the non the unassuming fucking summon, and not the actual threat, which would be the player. That's fine. That hurt a lot. Also fine. I wish he'd have dropped me or something, but... Oh well. Kinda was hoping for the shield, truthfully. Okay, now this is where this, uh... This glitch is going to work to its fullest. I mean, you can use it for the boss fight. But you talk to this lady. I'm skipping the dialogue in the game. Because, I mean, if you want the dialogue, you can play the game. It's not hard to play. Climb that invisible ladder. Now, you have to kill this little old lady. Look how sweet she is. 
That's why everyone gets to see my consequences first hand. Now I'm a murderer. Okay, let me let me stop and think about what I'm doing. Is this really the way I want to go about my life? Yeah, you know what, fuck it. There's worse ways to go than murdering old ladies. Fuck you. Okay. Now, here's the fun part. I have to survive this fucker until it kills the Swordmaster. No. Thank you. You two murder each other. Murder each other, I say. Dance for my amusement. <laughs> While I cower behind my shield. Kick his ass. Get him. Yeah. Okay. Now, while that's still saying that he's died, you exit the game. Preferably don't take that hit that I took, which probably almost killed me. So I'm going to run back to a bonfire. <laughs> Because everything's dead on the way. Like, everything that needs to be dead is dead. Actually, no, wait. No, actually, I'm, I ran past that entire first section. Fuck. I'd say I'd bring the summon with me, but... That wouldn't work too well, because I... Kind of have to... Not have a summon in my world to rest up fire. Fuck. I mean, that sucks kind of hard, but... I can make it back to that fire pretty easily with no Estus. Hopefully. Like... 75% mm, sure? Strong 75%. Oh yeah, that should have killed me. <laughs> that was very close to me dying horribly. Um, now I'm gonna run back here. I'm on a rest of the fire. Run back down. Yeah, rolling down the stairs. It's kind of funny. <laughs> um, then I'm gonna run all the way back down, and that will um be all I need to do. I'm not gonna show you everything else because, like I said, I made a I made a video on it a while ago. Fall in there. Yeah, that's right. It's been about a week ago that I made the video, so I'm just going to kind of let this video play out, and if it goes out, it goes out. You've seen how to start it, and like I said, if you've seen this video, then you've pro or if you've seen any of my other videos, then you've probably seen how to do this. I'm just doing this as like a formality, this way people know what I'm doing. I'm using a slight exploit so that I can, you know, just beast the shit out of this. Think about summoning one of these fellas. Jesus. Why not? Okay. Little message popped up. It's like, hey, prioritizing voice chat or party chat. You sure you want to do that? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I don't want to talk to these people. trying to lead him, but... I kind of just want to summon the time the fuck out. I'm about to say, I'm about to send his ass home. Shit. And if you weren't sure why I sent that other phantom home, it's because I needed one phantom in my world because I needed him to die. Like, even if you have two phantoms in your world, as soon as they both die, like, as soon as the second one dies, you're more than able to just exit, summon them both back if they're NPCs, and it'll trigger the, uh, it'll let it play through where they're invincible. This dude just dropped something both times I murdered him. It's always the goddamn pants. Now, oh. 
That's nice. Apparently none of these enemies pay me any damn mind. Fine by me. Fuck. You gotta be annoying. Ugh. Now we make sure this fella right here is invincible. And then we can summon somebody else to do whatever the hell they want. Because I'm nice like that. Wow, where the hell did I get this? And why do I not remember getting this? That's amazing. I forgot where I got this. I'll have to watch my own videos. <laughs> Shit. Come here, you bugger. Let's do this. Come get some. Can't hurt me. Can you hurt him, though? Nope. Can't hurt him. Good. Now what that means to me is, I'm going to go let Swordmaster handle that, and I'm going to go down here and summon me another fella. This one. Just because you just spawned. That's the entire reason. Congratulations. <laughs> On being randomly selected to join this one-sided fight. Now if you want a turtle, having a 100 block shield is really nice. Ooh. Because you can... You can kind of just like step around the enemy with your shield up. Now this is why I like fucking like three man teams. No. Now let's do this. That way he has one. Now, with this 100% block shield, I can just kind of do as I please. Oh shit, that's going to kill me, isn't it? As I said that, yeah. Now what's rough about that is, I was expecting to be able to rotate faster, so I wouldn't have to worry about it, but that was stupid as hell. I mean, he died too, so that doesn't make me feel as bad. But that was really dumb. Um, yeah, now that I've shown you that how I'm going to do this fight, I'm actually going to exit and like stop recording and then I'll just do this off camera because this is kind of a boring fucking fight if I just get one hit killed consistently and I have to make sure that I'm fo- well actually fuck it I'll just let this video end how it will and I'm just gonna try and focus as intently as I can on not dying which means I'm probably gonna not be talking too much but oh shit that was dumb why would you fuck with your inventory right there, damn it? Annoyance. As long as I don't have to heal again, I'm fine. And that fucking big ass bell, goddamn son. Ew. Oh. I guess he just.